Hi everybody, I've been playing with the Rabbit Hole Lamb Playground, and so I thought I would try to give a little bit of an overview. I've been playing with this a little bit, found some things that work and some things that don't work, but let me get going. I think the first thing that I would say is when you go to the Rabbit Hole, you have two options. You have the Lamb Playground for the web, and you have the Lamb Playground for the R1. We're in the Lamb Playground for the web, and over here on the left, it gives you a couple examples, and notice over here, you can't really type into anything yet and this orange button that says let's go is not really bright orange yet and so over here is the land playground and notice it says sorry your playground session has ended unexpectedly please refresh and try again and so basically what this is saying is um, either hit refresh or make sure you don't have other tabs open for a similar session and so I did notice that if I have multiple tabs open for the playground I will get this message or something similar I closed those tabs earlier but I left this here so you can see me hit refresh and so if I hit refresh and it says it's starting the playground session I think this is going to be a successful reboot and so now when I see Google I look over here and now I can type and notice the let's go button is orange so I'm just going to say please do a search for Hurricane Aline. Click on the first news article. And so I'm going to try to ask it something pretty simple. So let's see if it does it. So I'm really just asking it to do a search for Hurricane Helene. And I'm asking it to click on the first article it finds. And so it already did a search for Hurricane Helene in the Google search box. It's got a few options here. Let's see which one it picks. And there you go. It says it clicked on the first news article um, to read Hurricane Helene live updates. Hope fades in search for flood flooding disaster survivors from NBC News. So it did its job. That's all I asked it to do. And life is good. So a couple things real quick. When you are in this playground, it's kind of like a remote session. It's like a VNC session. So this web browser is not really your web browser. It is a web browser somewhere else. And so there are some limitations, like if there's sound, you can't hear it. If you want to download a file, uh, you may not be able to access that file. So keep that in mind. And it will ask you for your credentials. And if you decide to log into something that's in this playground, you are putting your credentials in a VNC session that is um, elsewhere. So do what's comfortable for you. But that's how you use this page and this site for the web. And so now let's try a Rabbit R1 session. And so now I'm going to go over here to the left and I am going to pull down and I am going to choose Lamb Playground R1. All right, so now notice it said no R1 Lamb active session found. And over here to the left, it says describe any task in natural language to your R1 and it will be automatically performed for you on the web. You can view the progress here in this left window. So this is going to stay here until you start your conversation with your Rabbit R1. So start your conversation first and then hit refresh and it will probably be successful. So I do have my Rabbit R1 right over here beside me. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'm going to ask it to do something simple, hopefully. Hi, Roger. Please search YouTube for a video to play a lo-fi video called Mandalorian. And so over to my left, it's thinking. I got the little bobbing action with the Rabbit R1. I hope I asked it something simple, but let's see what happens. So now I'm going to go ahead and hit refresh because I already asked it. So it's already searching. Entering the search for Mandalorian lo-fi video right to the Google search box. Okay, if you can't hear it over the planes, it actually said it was searching for the Mandalorian and it's still bobbing. Now it's clicking on the first option. Clicking on the first video titled The Mandalorian Theme, Lofi Hip Hop Mix, Star Wars Lofi, to access its link on YouTube. 
So what it's doing is it's telling me, the R1 is telling me what it's doing. It's not over here like I on the web. I the YouTube page for the Lofi video titled Mandalorian. It's telling me what it's doing on the Rabbit R1. It tells me that it's accessed it. And if I look over here on the uh, YouTube page, I just actually am just in the middle of a commercial. I can skip it here. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit skip. I can interact with these controls. I'm going to go ahead and make it bigger. Now, uh, I had mentioned earlier that this is a VNC or remote kind of um, session. So I am not going to hear the music. It is not muted. Uh, it's not on my computer, so I'm not going to hear that. I'm sure Rabbit, the Rabbit team is working on something to help with that. And also, you, uh, I think I had mentioned earlier that you cannot print from these sites. So if you try to print a page that you access through these tasks, it's not going to work. If you expect to hear something, it's not going to work right now either. But I can uh, mess with these settings and controls. So I can do subtitles. I can click. I can autoplay is on. I can, um, let me see how much bigger I can get it. Now I can get it small. I can actually click on another one too. And then so the airplanes are coming again. So I'm going to stop here. I hope this little session helped you a little bit. And let me, um, well, let me hit, ref let me hit refresh and, and try something real quick. All right. So because I already have been in a session, I think this is going to default to the last session. If I go to web, it's going to go back to my last session and I'm going to go back to playground. And now let me do this. I'm going to right click and I'm going to duplicate and notice it's trying. I have noticed that if I try to duplicate a page, it doesn't always work. And this one worked, so I don't know if it's just getting better or if something happened with my browser, but I usually, when I have two open, I usually don't have as much success. So let me try this one and go back to web. And life is good. And so, but if you notice that it's not working, I would close one of the tabs and I would try again. Thank you. See you later. Bye-bye.